I wanted to make sure just to check in with everybody. So this is the first episode. This is actually episode 18 of um, what was called Generation Jones, Too Young to Be Old. Prior to being called Generation Jones, Too Young to Be Old, it was called Generation Jones 1964, 1954 to 1964. So... It's interesting, but when you're doing podcasting and you're and you're tar- targeting an audience, um, and you come from a marketing background like I do, like branding background, it's like sometimes you get too close to something. So what I did was I got a little too close to what I was trying to say, and nobody understood what Generation Jones was. They everybody thought that I made that up, and not that I made it up, but it was like, well, what is that, you know? And they were confused by it, but yet they would agree to come on my show and they would agree to give an interview, and we would have a great time. Um, Through those interviews and through that process, which is now, like I said, this is episode 18, I have learned so much from my own interview ease (laughs) um, about what it is that people want to talk about and what people are feeling and what's going on out there as far as over 50 and over 60 and and the struggles that we have and things like that. So it's pretty awesome. So I um, so I decided to eliminate the name Generation Jones and focus on what was really important and what I really have to offer. And what I have to offer you is myself. And so it is the Wendy Cooper Show. And I, for those of you that haven't listened to me before, I have been on internet radio for probably over eight years. I did take a two-year break. Um, And this show is kind of my reinvention of myself because I am 63. And I am in a very timely place where there's a lot of talk about age going on out there. It's all over the place. And I didn't even know when I started this show. I really didn't know. It's like, oh, I'm going to embrace my wisdom. I'm going to, no, I'm going to share my wisdom. I'm going to embrace my age. And I'm going to do a podcast. And one thing led to another. And I looked at the generations. And I looked at this and that. But anyway, now I'm here. And this is the first episode or... It, it, you might not be listening to the first episode. Maybe this is just my rant that I'll I'll post and explain to everybody why I did Wendy Cooper show. Um, but it is now and forever going to be called the Wendy Cooper show. I do have a little tagline that basically says, you know, dot dot dot. Um, speaking of age, <laughs> you know, kind of like speaking of age, you know, or speaking of age. I mean, seriously, speaking about age. You know, everybody's talking about age for crying out loud. Um, and this is where I really want to give everybody a voice for that. And it's it's just going to be every people that I know, people that I'm meeting through social media, people that I know in my network of entertainment friends and celebrities and producers and, and entrepreneurs and artists and all that good stuff. You know, we're all going through it. And we're, there's, a, there's a theme out there that we want to follow and we want to all come together. And in coming together, it's kind of like this pro-aging movement. There's people on Instagram like um, Mary Frischman, who I interviewed. I am not sure what episode she is, but she's an episode. Um, and Robin Robin uh, Lynn, she is Robin Ageless on no Robin Robin Lynn Ageless on Instagram. And then there's Bobby Parker Hall. She's Modern Bodies Fitness on Instagram. Um, and I'm going to be interviewing. Um, Uh, Barbara Warren from uh, Perennial Project. Uh, But my shows also have people like Basil Buzz from NBC, The the Blacklist, and the founder of ARC, and he was a real-life spy in the CIA. And, oh, my goodness, he tells a heartwarming story about being on a rooftop in Mogadishu. Um, And Breonna Davis, who was in an Academy uh, uh, Award-nominated nominated um, Best Foreign Picture in 2016, awesome, Embrace of the Serpent. Um, And so, and I have a classic rock band. I love my interview. I think it was my interview number two, maybe, of, or maybe, yeah, interview number two. So episode number two, the classic rock with um, Heaven and Earth, Stuart Smith and Joe Retta. That's an awesome show. You really need to listen to that. Uh, and then the, the episode one was Saul Colt, who's an integrated marketer. He's pretty funny, too. And that was a show that I kind of like my first two shows, I really edited the crap out of them. And I made them say not say things that they didn't really say, but like I cleaned it up a lot. Right. There was a lot of stuff that was like, wow, 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 wow. I don't want to talk about that. But anyway, here we are. And this is whoa. 
Um, this is Wendy, the Wendy Cooper Show, live, recorded live from my home studio in El Segundo, California, the creative hipster capital of Silicon Beach. Yes, that is where I live. And don't come here. It's horrible. They cut down the trees and it's barren and <laughs> it's terrible. The location is awful if you're going to live in LA. You can't get anywhere. Um, but besides that, this is pretty awesome. So anyway, thanks for listening. Uh, it's everything is real simple. You know, it is wendycooper.com. Uh, send me an email, wendycooper at mac.com, or it can be wendy at cspot run. You can check out my DR agency where, did you know that I was the very first full service, uh, digital direct response agency ever <laughs> I that I created C-Spot Run in 1997 concept to consumer and everything in between even beyond um, yeah I still kind of have an antiquated website but it says it all and amazes me that that's what I know how to do so you should check it out that's the letter C spot run productions.com um, and you can find me on YouTube actually I have a lot of shows on YouTube from back in the day when I was doing UBN video and uh, I think there's like a hundred shows up there. I don't know why there would be that many, but I think that there are. Um, and you can watch them, their video, <laughs> their video interview shows. They're pretty funny. Uh, but thanks for listening. This is uh, the Wendy Cooper Show, and it will be forever. Send me an email, give me a review, subscribe on iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, Google Play, Google Podcast, you name it. You know, uh, it's all about sharing the love. So, um, Thanks for listening and enjoy.